Hi guys and welcome back to our channel. We are here thrifting 26th street which is awesome. This Southside thrift store has three floors. One of the largest ones here. Let's go ahead and see what we find. If you guys are new, don't forget to subscribe. Definitely checking out this first floor. It has a lot of big clothes. But you already found a good one. I'm not sure if um, jackets do good but this is a Sesame Street one. Look at it. It doesn't really have nothing on the outside like I guess the um, Sesame Street characters. Which I don't know. I don't know about that one. But it looks good. This brand never heard about it before. It just looks like something. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. If you guys do jackets, let me know. <clears throat> I love doing vintage clothes, especially if it's Disney. But when it comes to jackets and stuff, I've never resold jackets, so I'm not sure. This one, no. Let me see that one. That one looks vintage, okay? Ooh, I don't know what about this, but it says Blizzard Beach. Water Adventure Park. Oh my god, I'm out of breath because we went up a flight of stairs. This is the second floor. <clears throat> Ooh, there's a whole bunch of Disney little beans plushes here. I like that Kanga one. This hippo one. Rabbit. Ooh. The rabbit one does good. I've sold that one. Depending. Ooh. Mm -hmm. The two Angelica's. The twin. And. There's more Rugrats right there. But those are 18 bucks. That's crazy. This is crazy. They're pricing these $4. That's freaking crazy. We always see these Disney cups and the. Oh, these are cool. Five bucks. These. 99 cents. That's more like. It. Also, some Starbucks cups do really good. But this one's $13. No. Ooh, on this section right here, there's a whole bunch of like wooded and decor. Look at these canvases for a baby's nursery, like safari themed. That's pretty cute. They have a lot of canvases here. I don't know what that is, sir. Oh, the places you'll go. Oh, that's cute. Guys, if you guys are ever looking to like decorate any part of your home, definitely hit up a thrift store. Doesn't this look beautiful in a bathroom? So For real. Hello. Beach. Like a, a Airbnb. Today's a good day for a good day. Magnetic letter board. Ooh. Ooh, it comes with a letter. That's nice. These will look perfect in a kitchen. They're great. Canvases. That's pretty cute actually. Let's see the price. Uh, I don't know, I'm not sure. 179 okay. For Christmas. Ooh, if you guys were to see all the Christmas stuff, they have a whole bunch of wreaths. Bases. That's a that's a movie? That's from the movie. What I movie? The Venom movie. Okay. Let's go. Oh, that's cute. This is mostly Christmas stuff. No, 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 no Santa. <laughs> no Santa? As you guys can see, it's kind of a quick vlog, but we are on the third flight of stairs. Like, they're not a little bit, they're a lot of a flight of stairs. There's a lot of Christmas stuff here. Look how the overview looks, it looks insane. Oh, I've sold some of these. They're not so good, but I've sold some of these. They have a camera or something. This is where they put all like their seasonal stuff. Like right now, there's a lot of Christmas stuff. This is what the toy section looks like here. A little gecko. Look at all the pillows. What is that? There's just a lot of random stuff in bags. Over here, a whole bunch of bags also. And like more Christmas stuff. Here they have a whole bunch of toys. And then the other section is a plushie. Look at this section. Jeez, there's a lot of toys. Look at this. I love finding things like this. A Mickey Mouse one. Okay. Oh my god. Somebody went wild with all the toys. This is, I don't know what happened here. Everything is thrown. It's never like this. But let's go ahead and dig and see if we can find something. In a pile of this, like, look at this massive. I don't know what's it called, destruction, I guess. They still managed to find this Franklin puppet, this Grey Wolf Lodge Build-A-Bear. Still have to search it up. This Bruce. 
I already showed you guys one of these. They found the second one of this one. Hopefully, if they're doing good, that's um, that's awesome because we have two of them. And then this one that's also from Target. Back then. Back then Target. So like vintage Target. I don't know. But I remember seeing these when um like a while ago. And these are doing amazing. And also this one. This puppet right here that looks so cute actually. It's so soft. Softest thing ever. Bless you. They also found the clown. Oh and this epic thing. I was like wait what? Wait quick question. If you would have seen this you would have known Garfield. Because I really wouldn't know. Wait, wait, this was the crazy finest thing. Amazing if it works, but this one is in a very rough condition. Like, literally rough. Some buttons don't even press somewhere. Super epic vintage find, but most of them are selling because they're working. So, this one, I really don't think it is. And it is $10. And it, like I said, it's in a rough condition, so we're gonna go ahead and pass it up, but it's so cute. Ooh, and the way going down the stairs, we found another one of those circle bears so awesome i didn't check out this one it's a puppet so i'm gonna go ahead and check it out while we're gonna go through our three flights of stairs so yeah that was our thrifting trip look at all the books there's just so many books oh a lot of people research a lot of these and i honestly have no idea how you guys do it Searching up all of these. My mom used to collect these growing up. They're so cute. They always have here rare vintage stuff. Look at those Bigfoot, Oscar, and Cookie Monster. They look so epic. We have a lot of cool stuff here. Okay, guys, we made it to the end of the video. This was a really short vlog, which now I'm just realizing now that I'm editing this video. But oh my god, you guys, I feel like every reseller that does thrifting videos, like definitely you need to look up more of what has sold just because there has been things guys this video if you guys didn't know i've been hitting the thrift store so hard and i have been so backed up with so many thrifting videos this video was about a month ago just editing this video today um but it's gonna go up hopefully tomorrow we are currently in december this was filmed in november the plushes are still here you guys could see it right here the one that i was talking to you guys about this one's so so good and the reason why i said that you guys saw some screenshots it does sell so good just because there's so many sold and just a little bit of some listed and it's selling for pretty good like 15 16 i did get it pretty affordable for like i think a dollar a dollar 99 it was such a good find i would definitely be picking up plushes like that more in the future just because those are for sure gonna sell it's just a matter of time i actually got an offer on it i did get an offer of 12 and i was like i'm not gonna pick up 12 maybe 15 but i did post mine for 19 so definitely gonna wait for those if you guys see this one's a pretty big one the other one i shared with you guys was a smaller version the second one we found was kind of bigger definitely do your research while you're at the thrift store and also the franklin plush whenever i post any screenshots that says deliver definitely it has already sold which is pretty awesome that one sold so fast literally within like two three days of me listing it sold so fast what are your thoughts on these prices like it's going up so much but definitely let me know if you guys are resellers let me know what you guys are doing where you guys are going for your stuff that you're selling i still want to hit up the thrift store just because we have so many here in chicago if you guys have seen other thrifting videos Definitely you guys will know. Bless you. We have so many thrift stores here. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys enjoyed, don't forget to give us a big thumbs up. Don't, for don't forget to subscribe to see way more videos. I have so many videos coming your way. So definitely stay tuned for those. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.